um, when you take the guitar out, you've got, um, you've got a good case too. Yeah, it's all got a really good case. Really, really good. Where did you buy from this guitar? Either way, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah I know the place. I know the place. No, oh, I know the place. They're giving you a good case. A really good case. Oh, that's my brother's book. Huh? That's my brother's book. Yeah, it's your brother's book. Oh, you got you got two books, did you? Yeah. Oh, okay, no worries. All right, we'll give it to your brother later. Uh, how I take this out is put the guitar like that. This one at the bottom. I know. Then I take it out like this. Easy. Then I put it back in, and I strum it back up, zip it back up. Alright? That's the best way. I, there's no other better way than that. And then you can just put this like this. Good boy. Now, the guitar might be out of tune, um, so, okay, just want to do what I'm just, oh, here's guitar pick. <laughs> That's it, you can have the pick here. Good. All right, now, I'm going to teach you how to tune the guitar. I told your dad that he has to download this app. Do you what app? Uh, an app. Do you have a phone too? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he's got a phone app for me. It's called Guitar Tuner. Now, what I can do, huh? What did you do? It, it tunes the guitar. Oh. And it's got guitar chords as well. Oh, it does Yeah, it's got guitar chords. Um, now, what you need to do is strum one note, just do the top one for me. Just, okay, now with your, with your this hand here, don't worry about this hand, just do that note, just one note, yeah, just that note. Okay, too high, alright? It's too high, so because these guitars are brand new, I better do this for a second, I'll show you. When it gets tuned, see that's too high, the balloon. If I go down, because it's too high, I need to go down. Going down is this way. See? This way. To go, you see my left hand watch. I have to turn it this way. Because it's too high. Now, it'll ring when it's tuned. Alright? The balloon, see what, what colour is the balloon? Green. When it's green, it's tuned. And see what string I hit? This one, E. That's the bottom. Can you see that? Yeah. That's E. A. And then D. Good. Then G is here. I know. Then B is there. And E. Alright? Yeah. So there's your guitar. Alright? Mm -hmm. So we've got the first string. E. Tune. Correct. A. Correct. No. no, I have to go down. The balloon's too. The balloon needs to be floating in the middle. Is tuned. The balloon's too high, uh, too low now. So I have to turn, look what I have to do. I have to turn away. To get higher, you have to turn this away to go higher. Oh, I'm too high. Okay, there's the balloon. Next string, what's the next string that I'm going to do? What string is that? What string? G. Good boy. G. Good boy. He's really he knows exactly what I'm doing. G. G. So I go G. Is it too low or too? It's on the left. Is it too low or too high? Um, too low. Too low. Good boy. So I have to turn up away. I have to turn the key. This key has to go away from me. Good. G. The next one. Too high or too low? Low. No, too high. Too high. So now I have to go down. Good. There's the B. Now this is, and it tells you too low. See? See how it says too low? So I have to go higher. And now I have to turn. So you can experiment with this at home. Alright, there. The guitar's in tune. Now, let's, now, with the pick, strum. With the index finger, 
and we hold it and then we strum it. Good boy. Excellent. Good. Let's sit on the chair properly and turn this a little bit. Good boy. Now we'll keep the, the guitar on the right foot. Good boy. And you can use, oh, let's sorry, turn around a little bit. Use this foot here uh, to put it on the, that's it. Good boy, that's it. Excellent, good. So you can strum, do this exercise for me. and that's with your right hand good boy yeah good boy now this is your left hand I was telling your brother this left hand is our one that we have to put our fingers on I know it's all the fingers are here yeah 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 good boy yeah you have to put the notes on good okay I want you to put now you know this is called the sixth string what string is this one called one string. One string. One, two, three, four, four five, six. Six strings. Huh? Good boy. There's our six strings. Our left hand is going to go here. Put your first finger here. And then number two. Number two. On two string. Good boy. You're one step ahead of me. On two string, in the first box. First finger. There. I want you to put that like that. Now, well, look at my thumb here. Sorry, I forgot, what's your, what's your name? Opki. Opki. How do I spell it? A-B-T-I-N. Okay, and say it again, you know? Opti. Opti. That's a lovely name. Beautiful. So put your finger like this. Now, don't put your thumb like this, Opti. Put your finger here. So, what I'm doing here, Opti, is Put my finger here. This one here, that finger, this finger, put it to there. That's it, I think. Yeah. Now, now the thumb has to go. Has to, that's it. Good. So what I'm doing up to you is, if you can follow me, I put my thumb and roll the wrist under so I can use the tip of the finger. It's very important that you roll the thumb underneath. Up to you. Yeah. So put your finger here on the second string. This finger, here, on here. That's it, actually, on that one. Good, now, what I want you to do, with this hand, go to the second string. Good, just that string. Good, that's it. Do it again, actually, just to pick that string. Good, good. That's one note, now, take your hand off and see if you can put it on by yourself. Put it a bit down in here. That's it. And just use the tip of your finger. That's it. And that's not bad, not bad up here. You need to get the tip of that finger a little bit more. Press harder. That's a good boy. And don't put it on the fret wire. This is the fret wire. Never put your fingers on the fret wire because they block. You put it behind it. See how I do that? You just put it behind it. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. So you got the finger like this. Yeah. Like that. He's got his thumb position, so this is a good thing to practice at home. Okay? If you want now, you can strum. Strum as well. Good. So that's a good, that's an exercise in itself. Put 
putting your finger like that and strumming across. Good, good boy. I'm really happy, really happy. Really good work. Good boy. So remember, this has to go in this box, one box, tip of the finger. Good. Perfect, that's it. Yeah. Perfect, good boy. Do it again. Good. You've just learned one guitar chord. This is the beginning chord, and it's called C chord. You don't have to know why, think of it as a color. C chord. is go off on off so off and on yeah so you can go four strums off and on and then four strums on I'll go on first yeah and then off Selling, he's done a really good job. Good boy, good memory too. He's picking the note, he's got the note straight away. Good boy, Archie. I'm really happy with that. Really good boy. Excellent. Have a break for a minute. It looks like he's getting a bit. <laughs> if it's too hard for you, did you okay? Yeah. yeah, good boy. He's got good concentration too. He's got really good concentration. So this is good, and this now, you can help your brother a little bit, all right? Because you'll probably excel more than your brother because you're a little bit older yeah, we'll and you're stronger. Huh? We'll keep them? Yeah, they're yours, there. Yeah. You keep them, yes. You keep them. And to hold it, remember, hold it properly. Like this. Yeah. Hold it between your index finger, that's your first finger, and your thumb is like a grip. But don't do it too hard. It's firm, you know what firm means? Not too hard, but enough that it's not going to slip out. If I do it too soft, <laughs> falls out, yeah? But if it's firm, it doesn't fall, firm. If you do it too hard, it's too tense, too tense. Firm means that it's, it's not going to fall and it's relaxed, that's what I mean. Now my pick fell, and I need to pick it up, yeah. Now, this is an electric guitar, I wanted to demonstrate electric guitar, oh. so you can see what electric guitar looks like. That's my favorite. Yeah. Sick, I mean, he goes crazy, you know, back that, that movie. That's the Johnny Be Good. So, this is an electric guitar. This will take many, you can play an electric guitar, but electric guitar does many, many things. You can do bends, you can do bends, you can do rock, school of rock. Have you ever watched School of Rock? Yeah. That's with Jack Black, you know? Yeah, I know him. Yeah, yeah. That's School of Rock, yeah. And you can do this one. And I'll teach you that one soon. I like the and that's red called Smoke on the Water. I like the red one. Oh, he's got the bigger one yeah. than this. Oh, okay, yeah. So this is the big one. 
this is the three quarter yeah. and your brother's got the half. Yeah. I get it. Not that one is the biggest small. Small one, yeah, yeah. yeah. You, you could probably play this one. Yeah, yeah Dad could probably play. They're, they're very good. The small one's too small for Dad and I as well. They're too small, but that's good for your brother. And you could play the small one too, but your fingers, are, you've got good, strong fingers. Yeah. Let's do the C chord again. The one that, remember, uh, 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 left hand, that's left handed. Turn, uh, uh, uh. Turn it around. Good boy. Now you're right handed. Think of your left hand. It is the left is going that way. All right, to your left, the neck. So we've got this C chord. And now where are we? We're on the second box. We want to go in the first box. We want to go to the first box. Yeah. Remember the first box, that's the, yeah, that's it. Mm -hmm. And what string do we want? The second string. This one. Good, strum, good boy, strum that. Like we did before. Good, let's do another one. Third finger, first string, third fret. Third finger, third fret. One. So this is the new one we're going to do. Take that one off. This finger is going to go here. This one, here, here, where my finger is. There. That's called the G chord. Strum that one. Good. And use the tips of your fingers. You must use the tips. Tip. Not the side. Tip. Good boy. Open. We've got this one, C chord. Remember that one, the second one, and the G chord. So we've got three chords we've got. Good, there's a G chord. Do the C chord now. C chord. Put the finger back where, where it was. Number two. Here. Yeah, number two, but then on the first first box. This finger, this finger here. Move it across, move, move, uh, relax your fingers, Re relax. First, this finger goes there, here, here. That's it, but take these fingers off. Take these fingers, take these off, off. Just that finger, just that finger. Uh, you're a little bit too close to the wall. Just stand up for a second. Good boy. You're a bit too close to the wall, that's it. Good. Uh, just, just, uh, that's it, that's it, yeah, here. So you have to remember that's the first box. You need to go second string, first box. Good, strum that again. Good, that's called the C chord. Now do the G chord. Where's the G chord? Here. Oh, sorry, that's the G chord. So we've, we've learned a lot today, so I, that's the C chord, yeah. And the G chord was here, with this finger. We use this finger now. Good, that's it. Put this finger on here. Third box, that's it. That's it, good. Good, strum that, G chord.
Let's put the book here so we don't forget it. That's your brother's book. We'll put it. Oh, and also you need to stretch a little bit too. Stretch, because it hurts your shoulders. Yeah. I can see that it's hurting you so far. So do all these little things as well. Bend your neck and and you, you can, um, yeah, good boy. <laughs> He's so cute. <laughs> you can do like little things and you can, uh, many people don't show you this, but this, it's, it's, it does hurt your back. You can do sort of exercises like this. You know, put your hands above your head, open up your shoulders, because they do. It does hurt your hands. And if it's hurting you, yeah. put the guitar down, shake. I, I, I'd say with the practice, I haven't told you, but with practice, no more than ten minutes. Then you can have a break. And if you want to do another ten minutes, all right. You don't have to do. Have the guitar there for half an hour. It's not good. That's a good one too. Stretching the hands. <laughs> That's a good one. That's a perfect one. So stretch your hands. No one told me like this when I was learning guitar. No one told me I had to stretch because when you get older, you get sore. You know, we get sore arms and hands and you're, you, 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 when you're your age, you're invincible, aren't we? We're invincible when we're little. When we're little kids, yeah, that's it. Yeah, you can stretch. Yeah, this book will be really helpful. This will just demonstrate. I won't go over this today, yeah. but this will just. Yeah, you feel better now. How good do you need to feel now with some stretching? Yeah, yeah. But don't forget when you get home yeah. to download that app. Okay. And you can ex you can have fun with it too. It has games. Games? It's got games on it as well.